Hey you guys, it's Melissa from WhatWouldMelissaWear.com and today I decided to share something that I've only shared with my closest friends um, and I promise I'm going to keep this story time short and simple and I'll leave the heavy shit for my therapist. Okay, so growing up, my mom was a single mom and at one point she had to work three jobs to make ends meet and I realized that at those toughest times in my life my self-esteem would plummet i wanted what my peers had and that was you know name brand clothes a beautifully decorated home newly leased cars and the ability to travel internationally um my mom was doing the best she could but the teenage brat in me just thought this isn't good enough you know that was until I got my very first job at a fast food restaurant and I busted my ass working hard and when I got my first paycheck after taxes I realized that money does not grow on trees and I began to appreciate all of my mom's hard work and sacrifices even more so it was at that point that I decided I had to become a savvy shopper. So instead of looking for name brand clothes at the shopping mall, I began shopping at discount stores like Ross and at thrift stores like the Salvation Army and Goodwill. And I began watching HGTV to learn how to decorate like the experts, um, Food Network to learn about different cuisines, Travel Channel to learn about different customs and cultures. And I started to watch religiously what not to wear so I could learn how to style um, my body type with the pieces I already had. So let's fast forward to a couple of years as an adult. Um, I've lived and traveled abroad, I've worked and dined with wealthy individuals as a fashion stylist and as a nanny, and at one point I had everything I wanted materialistically, but I was so unhappy and I was depressed. Um, and I realized like I was trying to keep up with the Joneses and it was exhausted and it didn't make me happy and it won't make you happy. I realized that what would make me happy is living life on my terms and how I wanted my life to be and what I wanted it to look like. So living life beautifully on a budget. So I want to let you know that if you are financially struggling, it's okay. Do not be ashamed. Do not. Okay? You are worth so much more than your socioeconomic status. Like, so much more. And don't ever forget that. Point blank. End of discussion. I know how it feels to go without, and I come humbly at you. I want this to feel like a safe space when I share my tips. So each week, I'm going to share how you can beautifully decorate your home using secondhand finds or how to cook a delicious meal that's inspired by gourmet and international recipes or how to style and dress yourself with pieces you already own so that you don't have to feel like you need to go do shopping hauls um, and also how to travel internationally on a budget. I've done it and you guys can do it too. These things are attainable and you're worth having beautiful experiences and beautiful things and being beautiful. Um, so yeah, like just come as you are. Some days I'm going to look cute and some days I may be raga and just wear a robe or something, you know? Um, but yeah. So story time is concluded. I don't want to get emo on camera, but um, I've learned so much from the struggles that I've gone through and I've, I've become a better person for it. So if you're struggling right now, take the lemons and make lemonade. All right, so until then,